So are you someone who is planning to take 14-day NEC certification anytime soon? Then you need to watch this video. So starting from October 1st, 2023, Fortinet had done some major changes with their NEC certification program. And in this video, we're going to be talking about that changes. Okay, so make sure to watch this video till very end. Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Amit, your host for this episode. And if you're new to this channel, I would like to say welcome. You know, in this channel, we normally talk about things related to tech, IT world and ID certification program. And if it is that something interests you, please consider subscribing to this channel. So let's get into it. All right, so previously this 14-inch NEC certification program used to be divided into different levels, for example, NEC 1, 2, 3, and it was up to NEC 8. Uh, but this time they have changed their program with much more organized certification, you know, by mainly focusing into that role-based certification exam, much more like other vendors such as Microsoft, Cisco, and others. So let's talk about it. All right, so this time 14-inch have divided their certification into five different proficiency levels with 11 different certification. And I think these updates are designed to accommodate with varying level of expertise and complexity as you progress to the program you know and the best part is that you can learn what is relevant while earning those certification all right so the first certification from Fortinet is Fortinet certified fundamental you know it is an entry-level certification from Fortinet and it is best suited for entry-level cybersecurity professional or anyone who is eager to start their career into the industry so it covers the current threat landscape and teaches the basics of cybersecurity and it also provides you the high level understanding of most common cybersecurity concepts so the Fortinet certified fundamental exam validates that you have master Master the uh, skills and knowledge required to get the entry level job in cybersecurity. Okay, and to earn this certification, you need to complete two exams. One is core exam and one is elective exam. You know, in the core exam, you've got that introduction to threat landscape, and for the elective exam, you've got two options: that is, uh, getting started with the cybersecurity or uh, the technical introduction to the cybersecurity. And the best part, it's free. You know, you just simply need to go to the Fortinet Training Portal Institute and then sign up there, uh, complete the course, and pass the exam at the end of those course and uh, get certified. You know, and if you already have an active NEC 1 or 2 certification from Fortinet, then you will automatically get this Fortinet Certified Fundamental uh, certification. Okay. All right, so now let's talk about the next certification that is Fortinet Certified Associate Level Certification. Okay, so this certification is an Associate Level Certification and it covers more stuff related to high level operation of these Fortinet devices. And again, this certification is suited for those cybersecurity professionals who need to execute high level configuration and monitoring tasks into the Fortinet devices. And also, it is recommended for network security administrator of uh, small and medium sized companies. Okay, and to earn this certification, you need to complete one core exam that is Fortinet 7.4 Operator Exam. And again it is free you know you just need to simply sign up to the Fortinet training portal and then uh, complete the course module and pass the exam with 75% or higher score and then you will get this certification so I would highly recommend for you to do these two certification you know since it's free and valuable I'm pretty sure that these two certification will make your resume look much stronger so just go and complete this certification and add it on your resume all right so now let's talk about the next level of certification in this new NEC certification program okay so it is Fortinet certified professional level certification exam and uh, this is more like a combination of NEC 4, 5 and 6 certification exam and in this professional level certification Fortinet now have three different professional certification that is a Fortinet certified professional in network security, public cloud security and security operation. Alright so each of these certifications showcases your ability to secure applications and networks through deploying, managing and monitoring the different types of Fortinet cyber security products and the curriculum itself is tailored to cover day-to-day -day essential tasks just beyond the firewall operation and with this new certification you can now choose your career path that aligns with your aspirations you know whether it is network security network operation or if you want to go into public cloud such as azure and aws then you have that public cloud security option as well and to earn this certification you need to pass two exams one core exam and one elective exam I'll show you what I mean. For example, if you want to go for Fortinet Certified Professional Network Security exam, then you would need to pass uh, one core exam, that is uh, NEC 4, uh, 40 OS exam, and then you need to pass any of these elective exams. And it is same for other two professional level exams, and you can check them here. So basically, it's best suited for those who already have certifications such as NEC 4, 5, or 6, okay? 
All right, so now let's talk about the next level in the hierarchy in this new NEC certification program. Okay, so this certification is 4 year Certified Solution Specialist. Okay, so it is a Solution Specialist level certification from 4 and it is best suited for very highly technical people and for those who already have NEC 7 certification or for those who are preparing for it, you know. And in this 4 year Certified Specialist level, you have five different certifications and that is 4 year Certified Solution Specialist for Zero Trust Access, Network Security, Security Operation, Public Cloud Security, and OT security okay and out of these five specialist level certification there is only one certification that requires two exams for you to earn that certification badge and that is 40 year solution specialist for network security and in the core exam you have that NEC 7 enterprise firewall and in the elective exam you have three options and that is NEC 7 lab is uh, NEC 7 network support engineer and NEC 7 SD-WAN and for all of the certification you only need to pass one core exam okay like this Alright, so now let's talk about the final certification in this certification program and that is Ordinate Certified Expert level certification. So this certification is the toughest certification, you know, this certification requires the comprehensive knowledge and expertise in network security design, configuration and troubleshooting the complex network, you know. And to earn this certification, it is very much similar like earning the NEC 8 certification, you know, you need to pass both written and practical exam to, to get this certification. And as this certification demands extensive knowledge and experience with all the foreigner products in the production environment you know it is very important for you to have in-depth knowledge about all the security products from Fortinet. All right, so that's all about the different level of certification in this new NEC certification program. And now we're gonna talk about the pricing of this new certification exam, okay? So let's get into it. So there has been some changes with the pricing for this new certification exam. For example, if you're going for the certification that requires one day one core exam to pass, uh, like your solution specialist exam, then the price for that exam is going to be $400 USD. But if you're going for the certification that requires two exams, that is one core and one elective, then that comes down to a total of $400 USD for all the certification up until uh, your 40 net certified solution specialist level exams okay and if you are using vouchers to book your exam then it's kind of similar as well for example if you are going for a certification exam um, such as like your NEC 5 or 6 then you, the voucher can be used only once and uh, if you are going for an exam uh, like your NEC 4 7 or 8 then that voucher can be used twice and what I mean by that is that for example if you are going for the 40 net certified professional uh, network security exam then it requires two exams for you to pass, right? That is core and elective. So you can use the same voucher to book two exams, core and elective, uh, in a different transaction. All right, guys, that's all for today. And these are all the changes that Fortinet have done with their new NEC certification program. And if you want to do more research and want to learn more about this new NEC certification program, then I'll leave all the links down below in the description section. So make sure to check them out. And if you found this video helpful, please be sure to give that thumbs up and share your thoughts on the comment section down below, you know? And if you want to see more content like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I'll see you next time. Until then, take care.